laser harp. Um, what it does is read inputs from laser beams to connect uh, that are lined up with photo sensors. You move your hand to the beam, it stops the beam's kind of the sensor. The photo sensor recognizes that. It's then that signal is fed back into a box. My partner can explain this more better, but it's fed in, goes through this circuit, this microprocessor, where it's processed for data. And the signal is then passed through this here, the mic microprocessor, which is used to generate the sound output. It just turn on a PWM module. It sets a waveform for a certain amount of time. The waveform goes into this circuit. This <laughs> Maybe. Fed into the circuit. And it's, just, it's filtered uh, knockoffs, removes some um, unwanted frequencies, harmonics, and such. And then it's connected to a speaker socket to see so directly to the speakers. Oh, that's and it. It should be working right now, but it's not giving me signal so for some reason. Instead of having Right now we're on the right off this board because the light and the sensors is not good for today. The, the amount of light in the room is affecting how well our sensors are detecting the inputs. So it's just easier and more reliable to run it off this. And if it were in operation, how would it how would it work? You just move your hand to a beam and it turns on. My partner can tell you more about that. So basically the beams will be projected towards the four sensors. It must be aligned directly and by having your hands placed like this, you will you will just stroke through the beams and when the beams are completely broken, the sound will be produced.